Barca has come to Paris. Barcelona people suffer from romantic memories PSG, a club transformed by the wealth of its owners from Qatar, is a rather less romantic destination for a player that Barcelona fans hope will never turn away from them. At 34, Messi didn't want to leave the new camp, certainly not in the way he now does. Messi has agreed a new five-year deal, but the Catalan side, short of money, can't do it. PSG can the greatest thing Messi is arguably the greatest of all time, despite never winning a World Cup and winning the last of four Champions League titles in 2015. Winning in this arena is all that matters. Most for PSG and the owner Qatar, and that is why they are paying Messi 35 million euros a year for the duration of the contract. Barcelona have destroyed themselves to keep Messi. But they knew what a special player they have in their hands from the moment he arrived from his hometown of Rosario at the age of 13. Messi's signing story is well known. Watch the legend, when Charlie Rexic, an advisor to former Barcelona club president Joe Gaspard, wrote the player's contract offer on a towel because he didn't have a handkerchief. Messi made his La Liga debut at the age of 17 in October 2004 in a 1. Zero derby win over Espanyol against Messi's compatriot Mauricio Pochettino, and will coach him at the upcoming PSG. Barcelona fans have no doubt they have the stellar player on their hands after La Piga, nicknamed Messi, scored his first goal for the club. It was a match with more than 91,000 people inside the new camp on a peaceful Sunday in May 2005. Messi came on for Samuel Eto'o 88 minutes into the match. 90 minutes into the match, he pitched the ball past the keeper from Ronaldinho's superb assist but failed. 60 seconds later, Messi did the same thing again and this time it turned into a goal. That same month, Messi won his first national championship, also Barcelona's first championship in six years. The rest is history. He won his first Champions League title in 2006. Messi was 19 years old when he scored his first hat-trick in the Super Classic match against Real Madrid. After Pep Guardiola took over as manager in 2008, Barcelona became one of the all-time great teams with superstar Messi. In Guardiola's final season, 2011-2012, Messi scored 50 league goals. In 2012, he scored 91 goals in the calendar year for club and country. Messi left Barcelona as the team's all-time scorer with 672 goals and 778 appearances. His number of goals is a club record. The Argentine superstar is La Liga's all-time leading goal scorer with 474 goals, who has the most hat-tricks in Spain's top division. A year ago, Messi tried to leave Barcelona for free after being thrashed 8-2 by Bayern Munich in the Champions League. He was forced to stay after being told a compensation clause of 700 million euros if he cancelled his contract before the deadline, and then went on to lead the scoring list in La Liga with 30 goals. Messi has won 35 trophies with the Catalan side, with the King's Cup being the last in April, and it was easy when Barcelona president Joan Laporta said, We want to pay our respects. Forever grateful to him. In 2019, Messi won his sixth Golden Ball award in a ceremony in Paris. Cannot be replaced Barcelona, who famously paid for a year of growth hormone treatment for young Messi upon his arrival, insist in the past they have a plan to deal with his departure, whenever it comes. But in truth, their number 10 is irreplaceable, both on and off the pitch. According to the Catalan financial company, Diagonal Inversion Aids, Messi is worth more than his salary. The father of three, married to childhood sweetheart Aunt Donella, may have earned around 384 million euros in the past four years in Barcelona, but a company study indicates that he has generated an income of 619 million euros during that time. At the age of 34, Messi still has a lot to offer for his new club and for Argentina. Messi won Olympic gold with Argentina in 2008 but until July, his international career was best known for painful setbacks, 
losing the 2014 World Cup final and three Copa America finals. But in July, he captained the national team to victory over Brazil in the Copa America final in Maracana. Next year, the man brought to Paris by Qatar will probably aim for the final shot of World Cup glory in Qatar.